all a few of this in the same annoying error on your iPads or iPhone on your Safari when you are searching for something like this. It's popping up as Safari cannot open the page because the server cannot be found. So if you are facing this problem, you are exactly at the right location because I'm gonna show you in this tutorial how you can get tired of this type of problem. So let's get started without wasting any time. First of all, go back to your home screen. And then actually I have several methods to solve this problem. So hopefully any of them will fix your problem as well. So I'm going to discuss all about the possible solution to overcome this problem. So firstly you have to make sure that you have entered the correct URL while searching for something. If it's not the case, then go for the second method. For that, you have to make sure that you have a strong internet connection whether you are using the mobile data or Wi-Fi connection or disable your Wi-Fi connection and then enable it again or another one what you have to do is here turn on your aeroplane mode and after 20 to 30 seconds this should be turned off again and check whether the problem has been fixed so hopefully after this your problem must be fixed and if still problem is there then what you have to do is just go for the third method here is the settings and then tap your on general and then what you have to do is just again scroll it down here and type on data and time and here is the most important step here you have to turn the toggle on for the 24 hour time and set automatically and hopefully after this your problem will be fixed and if this trick also doesn't work for you then go for the next method for that again open up here settings app on your device and then here what you have to do is just look at Safari here here it is so tap on this and then again scroll it down all the way here and here is the advanced so tap on this and tap on website data and here is the remove all website data so tap on this and tap on remove now so just go back and here is the clear history and website data so tap on this and clear history and data from here and hopefully your problem will be fixed and if the problem still is not fixed then go for the next method for that what you have to do is just again open up here settings app on your device and scroll it down and tap on general and again scroll it down all the way here and tap on transfer or reset iphone and then tap on reset and from here reset network settings give here your password or your device and then tap here on reset network settings to confirm the process this will delete all network settings returning in the factory parts and no media or data will be erased so hopefully after this your problem will be fixed and if the problem still exists there then go for the next method for that simply what you have to do is just for restart your device by pressing the combination of the key according to your iphone or ipad's model so if the problem still is not fixed then go for the final method for that again open up settings up here on your device and then scroll it down here and tap on general and here is the software update so here check whether you have an update here like this if you have please update your device and hopefully your problem will be fixed so that was it guys for today's video so if the video is helpful please like and subscribe to the channel thanks for watching here you can see my swari is working right now